Almost every month, a new trending AI masterpiece captures everyone's attention. This month, it's the Messi Ronaldo AI videos taking the internet by storm. One account in particular is milking this viral idea, driving millions of views as he is one of the first to jump on it. But starting today, anyone watching this can upload their first three videos with ease because of how simple this niche is. Let's check out some of these videos and then I will show you how to make them easily. Drink water, Messi. Before I explain, let's see how we can create these videos ourselves and compare them with the ones already going viral online. We'll be using just two amazing AI tools to make this happen, so make sure to follow each step carefully skipping. Any could lead to poor results. For reference, we'll try to remake the Coca-Cola drama video we just watched. First, open your browser and search for Ideogram. Click on the link with this logo. This tool will help us generate the realistic visuals we need, which is key to making our video look authentic and professional, just like the viral ones. This website makes the most realistic images of real people, and it's amazing that it offers a free plan allowing you to generate up to 40 images a day, every day. That's more than enough to make two to three videos a day. So let's go back to the prompt box and create our first image. Remember, this video is just one example. You can come up with your own ideas to make even funnier videos. Now, let's generate our first image. Messy shopping and grabbing a Coca-Cola. You can even ask ChatGPT to help you with the prompt, or type it in yourself. Just try something like, messy shopping in a grocery store, wearing the Barcelona jersey in the drinks section, holding a Coca-Cola bottle. Then click on Generate Image. After a few moments, our images will appear. Now, I won't make you watch every image being generated since you already know the process, but let's move to our second example. Here, we'll have Ronaldo acting as a cashier at the grocery store. Type in the prompt, Ronaldo working as a cashier at a grocery store, wearing the real Madrid jersey, and generate the image. Just look at these results. They're incredible. The level of detail and realism is truly impressive. So let's download the best ones, and I will show you how to turn them into a video. To turn the images into videos, we'll use a website called Hyper AI. I'll leave the link in the description. Once you're on the dashboard, select the image to video option, and it will take you to this timeline. Upload your image here, and in the description box, explain how you want the AI to animate it. For example, I uploaded our first image, where Messi is grabbing a Coca-Cola from the shelf, and I simply told the AI, Make the character pick up the drink, then clicked Generate Video. Here's the result. But keep in mind, sometimes the output may be slightly distorted, so you may need to regenerate it. This explains why fast clips and frequent cuts are common in these videos, including the example we're using. Now, let's do the same for the second scene with Ronaldo acting as the cashier. I uploaded the image to Hyper AI and instructed the AI to make the character move a little and use the computer. I generated the video, and here's the result. The video is distorted toward the end, but we only need the first two seconds, so I'll show you how to trim it in the next step. Download the video once it's ready, and repeat this for each image you generate. I went ahead and generated the remaining four images off-screen to save time since you already know the method. Now, let's move on to the final step. For this final step, let's bring all the animated clips into CapCut as I've done here. We'll be adding a voiceover and making some final adjustments to ensure everything flows smoothly. First, click on the Ratio tab and set the video to Portrait Mode for TikTok. Now, arrange the clips on the timeline in an orderly sequence to create a logical flow of scenes. I'll walk you through each part. Start with the first clip, where Messi is picking up the Coca-Cola bottle from the shelf. Don't worry about using the entire clip, just split and remove any distorted sections. The main goal is for viewers to see that Messi is grabbing a Coca-Cola drink. Next, add the clip where Ronaldo is at the cashier stand, acting like a regular grocery store cashier. After that, add the city scene where Messi brings the Coca-Cola to the counter and Ronaldo appears visibly upset. Remember, these are the images we generated earlier. 
In the following clip, we see Ronaldo throwing the Coca-Cola bottle into the trash bin as Messi watches from the other side. Again, trim out any distorted parts to keep the video smooth and visually appealing. After that, add the clip where Ronaldo hands Messi a bottle of water. And finally, the last clip where Messi drinks the water. Each scene should transition naturally, guiding viewers through the funny storyline. Now, for the audio. We could use Eleven Labs to clone Messi and Ronaldo's voices, but to keep things simpler and maintain the humor, I've extracted audio from our example video. Add this audio file, then trim it to match the length of each clip. Make sure to align the audio with the visual cues. For instance, when Ronaldo says, drink water, Messi, it should line up with the clip where Messi is handed the water bottle. Finally, let's play the video and see the result. Drink water, Messi. By putting all these elements together, we've created a hilarious and engaging story that's ready for TikTok. The careful timing and editing will help keep viewers hooked from start to finish.